Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he says, هَلْ أَدُلُّكُمْ عَلَى تِجَارَةٍ تُنْجِيكُمْ مِنْ عَذَابٍ أَلِيمٍ تُؤْمِنُونَ بِاللَّهِ وَرَسُولِهِ وَتُجَاهِدُونَ فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ بِأَمْوَالِكُمْ وَأَنفُسِكُمْ ذَلِكُمْ خَيْرٌ لَكُمْ إِنْ كُنْتُمْ تَعْلَمُونَ يَغْفِرْ لَكُمْ ذُنُوبَكُمْ وَيُدْخِلْكُمْ جَنَّاتٍ تَجْرِي مِنْ تَحْتِهَا الْأَنْهَارِ All those who believe, shouldn't I guide you to a trade, to a business transaction that will save you from a severe punishment in the hellfire? And what's this big transaction? What's this big trade that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is calling upon the believers? What's this successful and achievable trade that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is calling upon the believers? Is it buying a house in this world? Or buying a successful company or business? Allah Azza wa Jal says, all those who believe, shouldn't I guide you to a trade? They will save you from a severe punishment in the hellfire. It is a trade between you and Allah Azza wa Jal. That Allah Almighty will save you from the hellfire and grant you the paradise that rivers flow from beneath it. What is that trade? Oh Allah, you believe in Allah and His Messenger first. You believe in Allah Azza wa Jal and His Messenger and the Day of Judgment. Then Allah Azza wa Jal says, but that belief is not enough. Then you sacrifice your worth and soul for the sake of Allah. That belief is not enough to say, I believe in Allah, the Messenger of Allah, and the Day of Judgment that Allah had prepared. But Allah Azza wa Jalla says, and you sacrifice your life and your wealth for the sake of Allah. You sacrifice what you love most for the sake of Allah. You give up what you love most for the sake of Allah. You transact with Allah Azza wa Jal and you trade with Allah Azza wa Jal that you give that soul and dollar for the sake of Allah. You give up what you love most. Give up what you love most. And then Allah will grant you success. Then Allah Azza wa Jal will grant you victory. Then Allah Azza wa Jal will grant you happiness.